Hi, I'm Dr. John Anderson, and I'm a dissertation supervisor. I think that actually the drafting of the chapters is a really important thing. Um, as students will know by the time they get to their third year, that actually the first draft of an essay, for example, is not the finished draft of an essay. But and actually, the thought process develops through the process of writing. So get something down. Even if you know it's not something finished, go and get some advice on that. Think, okay, where are my pitfalls? Where are my weaknesses? What could I be developing? Students will have some ideas of those already, but to get some confirmation on that and get some potential solutions to those problems to their supervisor is really important. I would suggest that the drafting process is integral. So don't think, okay, I can rattle out 2,000 words in a particular period of time and then that will be done. That's step one. It will take step two, step three, these iterations and these redrafts are really important. Students can think about that process if they think, okay, they did kind of a draft of their literature review back in the Easter. By the time they come back in the September, it's and redrafting is going to be a, probably a completely different document. So getting insight from that, realising actually, yes, chapters need redrafting and factoring that into the time process is really important. It can make the difference between a grade classification and your dissertation. I think what's really important to do is for students when they come back in the autumn semester of their third year to work out what uh, commitments they've got in terms of their lectures and their contact time timetable. If they've got free afternoons or even free days in some situations, think that's not free time now. Mm -hmm. That's time for my dissertation to be written. You've got the autumn semester set up in order to get any analysis finished off because there might inevitably be some problems in accessing interviewees over through August, for example, because people are off on holiday. So get all those done in the first few weeks coming back. Make a plan for how I'm going to deal with these six or seven chapters I've got to do. Perhaps give a week or ten days or a fortnight to each one of these things because there's a cut-off point in December for your supervision and it would be great if your supervisor can see a draft of every chapter by the time that, by the time that deadline comes around. So it's not something that could be left to the last minute. As all students will know, by the time reading week comes around, they'll be starting thinking about their the other assessed coursework for the other modules for that semester. So that first half of the autumn semester is crucial to get the dissertation up and running, to get it moving forward, to hit deadlines with your supervisors, to set, if you know what you're th the sort of student who needs a deadline set for them, then get your supervisor to set it for you in order that things can be done on time.